There, I thought I was going to be timely with this contest. But alas, I'm not going to be because it's <laughs> being put out of commission for a week and having three more missions show up is sure a thing. Well, I don't know if this is the ramp or just a ramp what makes me slide off all the time, but hey. Uh, <laughs> I guess that's fine, question mark. I, I seem to have almost thought that there was yet more something or otherness up here, but I don't think there is. Mm. I think the time may be nigh for me to just sort of keep going down this hole that looks suspiciously like a hole that I don't want to go down. I don't know, it's pretty perfectly formed shapes here. <laughs> That's not natural. <laughs> oh god, oh god. Do I have to rope somewhere here? Or or needs must I just jump down? Whipping the mouse around! This is Bioshock! Okay, never mind. Never mind that. I must have to jump down, but I don't really see how or why that would be the case. Maybe I have to jump across. Oh yes. Bala, jump across. <laughs> oh, Carolina. I misunderstand the lyrics, but I don't really know what they are. Okay, so yeah, there's that. Uh, but now, what? There's just this horrifying ramp all around place. <laughs> and I don't see anything else now. Maybe I'm supposed to climb down the rope. That seems plaus. I am Santa Plaus, bringing you the gift of intuition and random thoughts. Alright. This is clearly what I'm probably supposed to do, but careful of the end of a rope because ends tend to sneak up on you and sort of kill you and stuff. But there must be a ledge here. No! Musts have no bearing in this universe. Shapes rapidly changing size. Rise bites. Well, maybe I'm supposed to somehow pick the l No, wait. I'm not, because... Well, maybe I'm not supposed to climb down here. Can I even... Just throwing them around to see if I can spy any ledge, but no. So I'm supposed to come down here somehow. Oh. <laughs> okay, I guess I'll accept the loss of those players. Wow, this is odd and 3D looking. How the heck? Are these just particles sitting in thin air? That's trip looking. That's like freaking voxely weird looking. But anyways, I seem to be in some... I love how you can just turn these torches on. Like, yes, please, and thank you. That is very, very nice and well appreciated. Oh my god, what? How do you do these reflective... What? Wait. Thief can't do reflective surfaces. What the hell is this witchery? <laughs> weird. Maybe it's an elaborate fake with weird patterns or something. But... Huh. <laughs> I am blown away and mesmerized here. This is like freaking weird. I love this aesthetic. It's, this must be like new dark stuff. But anyways, what can I even do in here? Am I supposed to just like jump in, or is it supposed to be drawing my attention upwards by the fact that the blood is rising instead of falling? Well, I don't know. But there didn't seem to be anything here. I feel a sneeze coming on. That was a close one. Well, it seems to be a coffin, and it seems to be like the only place I can really go. And it was like the lion something key. <sighs> I FORGOT THAT READABLE- Also, this music seems to have started. I don't know if it was playing before or if I was just not paying attention or whatever, but hey. Trying to get back onto this friggin' rope, which is amazingly difficult to see so that I can get- Oh, there we go. Heh <laughs> boy, for a minute there. Alright, you can all stop screaming at me now. Jeez. Hmm. I miss the daylight. When we lived in a canyon, I would gaze up at the rocky walls above and imagine myself one of the birds. I could peer into the depths below and wonder at how far they went. When the walls of the canyon moved slowly together, making the sky a tiny sliver and then blotting it out entirely, I was sure we would be crushed in between. The master promised that the gods would not harm us, and he was right. But though the walls are motionless again, the darkness seems to crush ever tighter against us. My little hiding place here beneath the house used to bring comfort because it was confining. Now it feels more open than anywhere else because it is the only place where a small light reflects brightly. The darkness of the open cave is the closest wall of any pressing against my face. I know that my place is by the tomb, that I am to be steward some day. But why does dead Onatus need a steward? The Brecken magic seems strong enough still. Just being in the tomb sends chills down my spine. The master says the illusion will not harm me, but it makes me think of death in ways that even other tombs do not. 
The master still has not told me how to dispel the illusion. I once told him that I had a guess, and he said, There is no need to guess. If I were to leave, where would I go? In the center of Kareth Din, rock walls are still moving, and fire flows from the cracks. The master claims that he does not worry, but I can see the fear in his eyes when I bring him news from the council. I am an outsider there anyway. Though I am a native, my life here above the tomb is influenced more by Brekka, however distant it is. The master is right. This is where I belong. I am still Khoja, but when he is gone, I will give up my name and call myself Steward. Okay, well, that was like not a hint at all, so... This mission is really unique, though. I mean, I haven't really seen another one like this where the objective is to fall. Oh, look at that, like, roundness in the design. So, I've got some hint about a bird and a rat and a bat and stuff, but, like, I don't see any markings here for those, so maybe I'm supposed to, like... Oh, you can't even turn them off without what? Are you freaking serious? Well, I don't really know where else to go other than like to just marvel at these reflections on the walls here. Well this note here talks about the tomb, mentions a tomb, and then it mentions the bird, dog, cat, bat puzzle, but like, I don't really, yeah, there's no representations of that here that I can see, and I don't really think there's, well I mean, I'm, I must be able to get down further, you'd think, because it exists, and like, why would any author waste, uh, waste space in a in a size limited mission by having nothing you know what I'm saying even the loot shimmers look at it the loot is reflective the loot is reflect <sighs> well apparently you know yeah the pathway to I guess this is presumably the tomb I mean it's a tomb <laughs> so I'm supposed to climb these like those ladders and the no so 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 yeah and they're supposed to be like there was originally a path here what led to, like, Peddler's Path or whatever, but I can't friggin' see, and it's kind of frustrating. Yeah. I think some of these books are a little too long, because I have to read all of them to try to find clues in the midst of story stuff, and it's, you know, eh. Cats, bats, dogs, rats, ladybugs, what's the significance? You'd expect there to be a depiction of such animals somewhere here. Or something. There! There's my little bat, cat, dog, rat thing, so I guess I... <laughs> they're just like up there. Okay, I, can't, I get it. Okay. Your eyes are supposed to be drawn upwards by these, but I just think these are a little small. But I guess that's the puzzle. That's the joke. You know, because if they were too obvious, it would be too obvious. So now I have to read up on the order of these things. I probably just have to hit them in this order, huh? Bird, dog, cat, bat. And I probably just have to, like, shoot arrows, I'm guessing. I don't have any broadheads, so maybe I'm supposed to use, like, I don't know, any kind of arrows, maybe? Cats, bats, what? Oh, what was it? Birds, dogs, cats, bats, and I can't zoom with an arrow selected. I didn't fix that, but birds, birds, birds. You know, this probably isn't what I have to do. Why would I shoot it with a water arrow? I really don't think this is it, man. Like, it's something to do with this, but... Huh. Because there's multiple ones. Huh. You know, these seem to be in a random order. Maybe I'm supposed to find the one that... The part of it that matches up with the listed order? Well, there it is. Bird, dog, cat, bat. Now, do I have to actually shoot these? Or is it just like I have to look closely where they are or something? Well, I don't know. Let's give it a shot. Bird. Dog. Cat. Hmm. Well, it does say something about, you know, the times of the day, but I thought that was just like... The order of them. I don't really understand this puzzle. I'll level with you guys. I just don't get it. I can see certain elements, but I have no idea what I'm supposed to do with them. One would think the puzzle was figuring out that, you know, these little bat-dog animal symbols are here, and that that would be the puzzle, but apparently there's another part to it that I have no frickin' idea what it is. Like, is this wood? Can I rope up here? I can! Okay. Oh. Damn it. Okay. 
so you're supposed to touch them in a certain order, which I think I figured out. High noon. Evening. Well, you can frob some of them. What are these dark spots around them for? Are those just decoration? I guess. No, wait. The rotation. High noon. Wait. This is like super geometry algebra time expert puzzle solving hour. There's these four dark spots around the edges and like these two are the same, but then that dog over there, if you can see on the left side of the screen there is different. Its spots are like rotated clockwise a bit, but I don't know what four dots mean. There's a triangle and there's fires at the edge. This is like no clock or anything I've ever seen. I'm guessing these rotations are supposed to represent the time of day somehow, but damned if I know how. Or it's completely wrong and they're just different depending on if it's a bird or a bat. Yeah, I think that's what they are, possibly. Because I think... Bird, bat, bat... Yeah. Well, the cat's different. I don't know why, but eh. Bird, dog, cat, 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 bat. I don't get it. There's tons of them, and I can frog them. Like, what am I supposed to do? Hit all of them or some shit? Like what? Okay, this puzzle's intriguing. It's like the interesting kind of hard. So. I do not want to look up the solution here. I, you know, I don't want to stop the video before I've solved it, but, uh, so I guess I'll keep going. I don't think there's anything brute force here. I don't think I should have to go around... I don't think I have to go around clicking every instance of a bird and then every instance of a dog or whatever. There's something a lot simpler and finesseful about that that I'm just not getting. Not a simple order of the icons puzzle. It Something more. Is it to do with the compass directions? Like, bleh. this is gonna be so freaking satisfying when I f when I finally solve it. Like, I'm all frustrated right now. But you know, if I solve this myself, I'm gonna be like, yes. And if I look it up, I'm gonna be like, the no. So, whatever the hell that meant. The birds sing in the morning. The dogs bark at high noon. But high noon and midnight are like both 12 o'clock on the clock. I don't know what the sun position is in a compass. Maybe it's not that at all. What the hell? What is the morning? What is the morning? If it's not first, why are there multiple icons? What is... <sighs> Back and forth on whether I like this or not. You know what? I'm probably overthinking this. I usually overthink things because I assume they're massively complex. It's probably real simple. Probably. Just don't know. This is stupid bullshit about... Poetic bullshit about morning, noon, evening, and moon have anything to do with anything? I mean, they're all in order, but pressing random ones in order doesn't seem to do anything, and there's tons of them! I literally don't know how to solve this, so I'm gonna have to leave it here. It was either that or look up the solution, which is dumb, I think. <laughs> I'm not sure anymore. But anyway, see you guys friggin' later, and bye for now when I end this mission in two seconds. I'm sorry, but that's just how it's gonna have to be. Bye for now.